We put the moron code in the mainframe, you guys. Chapter 6, The Fall. Yeah, sucks for you. Three kilometers. But since we're not busy other than that, here's a couple of facts. He's not just a regular moron. He's the product of the greatest minds of a generation, working together with the express purpose of building the dumbest moron who ever lived. And you just put him in charge of the entire facility. Nice. Nah. Forty two jeez. Thing is deep. Bonk, bonk, bonk. And she's got the long fall boots, she's fine. She's got the long fall boots, she's fine. What is that? <laughs> that bird's eating GLaDOS. Where'd she go? Oh well. Who cares? Why is there, like, daylight? I thought that this was, like, supposed to be deep, 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 deep underground. Well, at least I understand how to bypass obstacles. Fair enough. Uh, let's see. Alrighty. Now what do I do? Ah, oh, this seems like a way forward. Ooh, scary though. Condemned test area. Do not enter. Keep out. Do not enter. Keep out. Warning. Condemned. Keep out. Do not enter. Um. Even deep holes can get sunlight. Usually not for very long, but it can happen. Hmm. I presume I'm supposed to... Actually, where am I supposed to go? Where am I supposed to... No, not over there. Um... I mean, the keep out signs are giving me a pretty clear indication that I need to go here, but. But I don't see, like, any sort of, uh, way to get in. Seems to be a bit, uh, unfortunate. There we go, never mind. I found it. Um. There we go. Okay. Coolio. Sorry about that. I got a little confused with the uh, non-linear landscape environment that they had put me in. Silly game designers. Don't they know that if they don't make me walk along a completely straight path, I'll get confused and unhappy at the game? I'll walk along this pipe just in case. Alright, time to jump down. What's this button do? Ah, that's a big door. Ooh. 
Maybe there's a button in here that I can press. Hatch reclusion over override. Yes, yes there is. Oh, I see, I see. So not only do I need to do that, I need... Oh, well, okay. Oh, boy. Wait, am I stuck? No, okay. Uh, I legitimately thought I was just stuck there. Okay. Here's this one. There we go. We got them both at the same time. Easy peasy lemon squeeze. Something tells me it's going to kind of screw up that whole area right there. We'll see. No, no, it did not. I'm actually a little bit surprised. I thought they were going to make me puzzle my way into figuring out how to get up there. Okay. Oh. Perfect. Why is there a chair here? No, I want to move the chair. Fine, I guess I'll open the door. I guess I'll open the door, you guys. Flashbacks to where we just were in the past segment? What is this, Outer Wilds? I am, uh... Oh, wow. It's curse bloosh. Does anything happen here? We, uh... We looking at... Nope, nothing over there. Keep out. Containment area. I feel like I've gone to the wrong place here. Yes, I believe I've gone to the wrong place here. Where am I supposed to go? Doesn't seem quite right, but, uh... Hmm. Well, maybe I'm supposed to just go through here. Yeah. Yes, yes, I was. All right. Welcome to the London Amateur Finals. Astronauts, war heroes, Olympians, you're here because we want the best. And you are it. So, who's ready to make some science? I am. <laughs> now, you already met one another on the limo ride over, so let me introduce myself. I'm Cave Johnson. I own the place. Here's the Cave Johnson. The voice you heard is the lovely Carolyn, my That's, That is actually awesome. Elevators out of service. Very unfortunate. Science innovators. Yep. Wait, how am I supposed to get over there? Am I supposed to get over there? Or am I supposed to go over that way? Um... Now I am a bit confused about which way we're supposed to be going. Up there, perhaps? Yes. This game really likes taking you, like, making you up to really difficult to access places. Um, are we supposed to be going up here? I actually don't really know what my goal is. I'm just kind of walking. Uh... Like, the fact that this is a portable wall is surely means something, but what it means, I haven't the foggiest. Oh, dear. Hold on, I think I see it. Alrighty, then. I understand what's happening here. Ow. 
Aha! I solved it. He sounds like a guy with a mustache. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today, just follow the blue line on the floor. Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. I do want to hear this. What's up? Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you. Fighting an army of mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. All right, all in the name of science. You're right, I am thinking with portals. I'm like, hey, this is a, this is a wall I can access. What does it do? I don't know, but it does something. Also, not gonna lie, I was like, <laughs> I was a little worried that I was gonna have to climb all the way up this. I'm like, either this tower is here and I'm gonna have to climb up the whole thing or, but no, there was a lift, zoom. Alrighty then. Hmm. If you've cut yourself at all in the course of these tests, you might have noticed that your blood is pure gasoline. That's normal. We've been shooting you with an invisible laser that's supposed to turn blood. Okay, that makes sense. So all that means is it's working. I think the doors talk if you interact if with them. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Just a heads up, we're going to have a superconductor turned up full blast and pointed at you for the duration of this next test. I'll be honest, we're throwing science at the wall here to see what sticks. No idea what it'll do. Probably nothing. Best case scenario, you might get some superpowers. Worst case, some tumors, which we'll cut out. All right. Thanks, Cave Johnson. You, uh, you've outdone yourself once again. Am I not supposed to go over here? Uh, hmm. Wait, did they let you walk all the way back to- No. Zero chance they just let you walk all the way back down. I'm not gonna do it, but... Oh man, that would be uh, a little ridiculous. Anyways, which direction do we go? If you've cut yourself at all in the course of these tests, you might okay. that your blood is pure gasoline. Problem. Where the Normal. fuck are we going? I can't jump over these things, so I'm not supposed to do, like, some sort of random parkour here. But where am I? am I? I'm trying to go... I, I assume I'm trying to go up. Hmm. Makes sense if I was trying to go over there. But I can't find a wall to hit. A uh, clue is that the elevator shaft is a part of it. Well, I mean, I assume that I would need the elevator shaft to get somewhere. Um, like, that's down there. We, were, we already went down there. The elevator shaft is part of it. What? This doesn't even feel like a puzzle. I'm just confused about where to go. Uh, let me see. Let me, let me think. Elevator shaft is a part. Like it? Yeah, it should be, shouldn't it? Like, do I? I there's no way I just need to go down. Yeah. Well, you know what? Fuck it. We'll, we'll go. You go. I'm going. Okay, so I am going to the door with Alpha on it. Uh, 
the heck? Yeah, I mean, I was gonna say that 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 would that would be what makes the most sense, but um. Hmm. Obviously, I can't just like primary fire on over to it. I'm just super confused. I am super confused. What the hell? Uh, great. <laughs> I'm gonna spend a little bit of time just like wandering, just like looking around confused, like trying to shoot the same things that I've been shooting for the past like 20 minutes. Unless, uh, I do need to go downwards. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. Before you say something, I might have started to understand what you're trying to say there. Um, is there something on here that leads away from it that I can... No. My best suggestion is to explore everything you can. That's valid, I guess. Oh, shit. Well, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I love watching the puzzles. You know what? Fair enough. This is this is a puzzle. Even if it's just moving forward, this is a puzzle. Um, so. Alright, well. Only thing I can think of is walking like all the way down here. And I still can't hit anything over there, so. I've done that so many times. I'm glad to know I'm not alone. I just feel dumb, like, if, if the elevator shaft is important, then why am I going back up? Or why am I going back down? Unless the... Now, there's not, like, some sort of wire. I mean, there are places I can portal to. You don't go, need to go all the way down in the elevator? Alright, well. Well, if the elevator's part of the answer and I'm not supposed to go all the way back down, which would be kind of dumb, because why would I go up if that was the case, then? The game might be so polished that I can't get stuck, but doesn't mean it's so easy that I can't fail it. Let's try this. Uh, oh, wait, what? I can go higher? No, this is just like normal. Okay, sweet. Hmm. Yeah, it's randomly shooting. There's one white surface I haven't put a portal on yet. Oh no. Oh no, really? What would that white surface be? I put one on there already. Um one on there already. Let me see. Where where could we be going? <laughs> I'm sorry. I know this must be extremely frustrating to watch. Um, I have put one over there. Here's what here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking I have. Really? <laughs> here's what I'm thinking. I have gone over there. I, I'm pretty sure that that area with the cave Johnson doors is a part of the solution. It's not super hidden or anything. I'm just dumb, I guess. I'm, it's gonna happen, and then I'm I'm immediately gonna be like, okay, well that's that uh, clearly there's really okay. I guess I'm gonna use the zoom function this time. The zoom function will help me not die. Fine. All right. Uh. Perfect. Okay. Now I should be able to access it from here, right? Oh, 
of this, aren't Hmm. You can see it from your current orange portal. Really? Okay. I can see it from here, huh? So many times when I landed. <laughs> yeah, fair, fair. I can see it from my current orange portal? Is it up there? Did I do it? <laughs> I, uh, don't know that I did anything. Oh. I think I'm gonna die now. Yeah. Part one. Well, that's, that's one, that's one step for small man, one giant big leap, uh, into death. Sorry, my clues are shit, but you're nearly... Nah, your clues are fine. Your clues are fine, Mudlark. Only I knew how to use them. I'm still stuck because I'm no closer to finding the alpha door. Um, I'm just not entirely sure how I would... Oh, I see. Oh, I think I see. Um. Well, hold on, hold on. I, I think I know what generally to do, but I don't know where to do it. Here, hold on. Okay, this, this is going to be the definition of cheesing it a little bit. Okay, you ready? Hold on. Fuck, hold on, hold on. God, I can't kill myself when I... I can't even kill myself when I try. No, that's not it. Okay, hold on. Nope. Ah! No, okay. Well, I thought that that was a... Uh... I thought that that was the strategy, but that was apparently not it. Is there a... Uh oh. There does not seem to be a surface that I can land on is the problem. And, uh, oh, crap, well. Oh, that's not good either. <laughs> what I'm wondering is if... Like, I feel like I have to fall, but that's probably just not the right place to do it. Okay, let me see if I can blue there, and then some sort of... Or no, I can't orange that. Hmm. Can I jump somewhere? Uh-oh. Nope. <laughs> that wasn't it either. I'm assuming I have to build some giant vertical velocity in order to, uh, in order to, to make that jump work. But where I could build that velocity without doing anything is, uh, somewhat beyond me. Where I could build that velocity and fall into a portal is a little bit, is a little bit beyond me, rather. Unless what? See, I'm trying to launch myself. You see what I mean? Hmm. Maybe that's not it. Maybe I just have to, uh... Maybe I just have to jump on those tanks and the first time I fucked up? No, I definitely didn't. Definitely wasn't it that time. 
I'm gonna try that one more time, but I assume that that's not the right path. I assume that you're not supposed to use that little height advantage to uh, jump onto those tanks. Oh, wait. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, launching is the right thing. Iceberg, thank you for the redeem. Um, I actually need to use the restroom very quickly, so I'm going to run an ad break, uh, and then <laughs> I'm going to run an ad break, and I'll be right back. All right, I am back, and we have hydrated. Okay. So if launching myself is the correct thing, I need to figure out how to launch myself, which one of those over there. And then it would seem like jumping off of here to get the uh, verticality is the right thing to do, but I don't think that there's actually a way for me to do that. Only, wait, push bar door closing? Weird. I don't know if, the, like, I, I, I tried jumping off of there and portaling onto there. Um, hmm. Where exactly, like, like, nothing here is portal a bull and except for maybe like that aperture thing but nope we're lighting that sucker up and not getting a thing let's uh go over here actually like it seems like we god i feel bad but i kind of want to try this again because it it actually worked the other time uh, let's load that save An earlier clue is that the elevator shaft is important. You're right, you're right. The elevator shaft is important. If I jump down, I'll see something here that makes sense. Oh. Alright, well, I see what you're talking about now. I... <laughs> I do want to see if I can cheese this. I, I I know what the solution is now. Um so thank you, thank you, Iceberg, for the uh for the subtle clue. Um that got me there. Oh, hold on. It's a little bit safe. I wanna say that I can parkour this. And this is gonna be wasting time. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. But uh I wanna see if I can parkour this. Because it is on my honor as a gamer that I should be able to do something that is really not recommend. Oh, damn it. I'll give myself three more tries. Because I made the jump at one point, and I might be easier than I thought it was. Yeah. Yes, okay, there's one. Nope. Alright, two more times. Two more times. Because if I can cheese it and get there, and I don't think I can because it's like it's it's a little bit blocked, but I want to see if the developers put in the uh, the ability to just maybe try that sucker out. Okay. Nope. One more for the road, and then we're gonna do the the actual way of way of finishing it. All right. Actually, nah. Here, we're just gonna go ahead and uh, do that. Oh, I didn't really need to do that. Now we've got to go all the way back up. Oh wait, no, no, no! I don't actually didn't want elevator control. Oh god damn it! But uh, but I've, I've I got it now. I got it now. Why is it so slow when I'm on it? Come on, GLaDOS wasn't right, right? I'm not... I'm not that thick. Okay, I might be that thick. 
<laughs> I apologize for the fact that, like, the hardest puzzle in the game for me was falling down an elevator shaft. There we go. Oh, E. All right. <laughs> let's, let's get on with the rest of the game now. Yay. Oh. It's been so long, I don't even remember what we're doing here. Trying to get out, I guess. I don't know why I activated the pump station. I'm not sure what that's supposed to do for me. Oh. Okay. Alrighty, perfect. It is really nice being able to just walk up vertical surfaces with this portal gun. Basically. Um, okay. Gel flow. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand-holding. All right. Did my... Did my ear tubes get emulsified? I hope not. Ow. All right, let's get started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. Or so I'm told. Remember, this test is unsolvable without an Aperture Science Portal Quantum Tunneling Device. If you have not received one, please find a test associate before participating in a Shaft 09 enrichment act activities. Dietetic Pudding Substitute. It's true! Sweeter, slightly less toxic form of fiberglass. Causes subsequently ingested food items to bounce off the lining of a dieter's distended stomach and out his or her mouth. Fair enough. Uh, lawsuits concerning public outrage over. Boing, 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 boing. Okay, well, I guess we'll just bounce. Interesting, cubes are still a factor, even this late in the game. Alright, sayonara, suckers. The lab boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. I pay the bills here, I can talk about the control group all damn day. You do you, Cape Johnson, you do you. Oh shit. Um, we're gonna ignore that. We're gonna pretend like I'm an I'm a I'm a good gamer that's good at gaming. And uh, anyways, speaking of, where the fuck do I go? Um, I need to find a wall. Here's one. Perfecto. Do I go this way or do I go this way? Probably this way. There seems to be more stuff this way. Huh. Okay, well, maybe not more stuff, but certainly there is stuff there. All right, let's try this one. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. All right. Thanks, Cave. Oh, God. Oh, 
Wait a sec. Orange. God damn it. <laughs> oh, there's an emulsion. Oh, wait, no, we already knew about that one. Okay. Cube, please. Thank you. There's yeet. Can I yeet the cube? Uh, no, not really. Oh, God. Oh, no, it's bouncing chaotically. Oh, no, the chaos. Oh, the chaos. Oh, dear. Nice. Never mind. We're good. We're solid. No, we're not solid. Damn it. I wanted to see if I could uh, if I could do that. Right, orange portal there. A lot of this game is me just saying, "Hey, I wonder if this works." <laughs> Twenty percent of the time, it's when I already know the solution. But a lot of me wants to know, "Hey, does does this work?" Well, that's interesting. I presume I need to fall. Or something. Oh, I need to build momentum to uh, to get over here. But how do I do that? Oh, wait. Oh, I just bounced because of the blue gel. I'm stupid. Never mind. Whew. If I get a running start, then maybe that'll work this time. Okay. Sorry for being dumb. I'm dead. <laughs> nice job, everyone. We did it. We drowned ourselves. We fell right into the hole. We hold ourselves. Yeah. What does this do? Okay, then. Um. Oh, I see. It's telling us that. Okay. Behold. Indeed, Arena. Oh, that's a, okay. Well, that's a decent way of introducing a new mechanic. I'm a little mad at myself for not getting it, but. Um, oh, I see, I see, I see. Now all we've got to do is... Bonk! And here's the exit. Oh, in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. All right. Jeez. I do like the Cave Johnson bits. They're pretty funny. They're pretty funny. Well, I think I've squandered most of my uh, pretty decent early game progress with some pretty terrible progress here, so let's try to keep up. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping, because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. Good news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. I punch those numbers into my calculator. It makes a happy face. All right. Oh, the exit's up there. Cool, cool. That's going to be tricky because I have no idea how I'm supposed to get from point A to point B. Let's see. Well. I certainly hope I was supposed to drop down here. 
Because if I wasn't, then that's really, really sad. Hmm. Yeah, no, if I wasn't supposed to drop down there, uh, <laughs> that's bad. Oh, sweet. Okay. Place for me to go. A lot of people do. Oh, jeez. Ah, well. I guess then I don't have to feel terrible about my, uh... My hideous lack of progress, then. Hmm. I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Speed counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. Okay. Um, let's see. Where are the... Oh, I can't do that. Oh, I've got to press the button to get the blue gel. There we go. Bruh. Okay, you know what? Well, I'm covered in the blue gel. That's good. Probably not that good, but okay. Uh oh. All right, I think I've got, I think I understand how to get this one. Bonk. And then. Oh, yeah. Or wait, maybe I don't need to do that. Maybe I just need to, to fall from space. There we go, I, I think. I think. I see the sign that says exit. I don't see how to get there. Oh, you know what I need to do? I know what I need to do. Nope. Not quite done getting that blue gel bounce yet. Yep, yeah, there we go. Wait. I just want to sploosh that area real quick. Alright, let's get this one done. Blue gel. For some reason, like, the blue gel was not as intuitive to me as, like, all the rest of it. I'm not sure why. Bingo, bango. Coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress. Classic science. Don't think about being poisoned. If you do, you will become poisoned. All right, more blue gel time. Control group Kepler seven. We implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely, you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. Okay, well. I could certainly do that. I could also certainly do that and see what happens. Okay, so that water gets uh, kind of destroyed a little bit. Or that water destroys the gel. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Hmm.
the f oh, oh, no, hold on. That's what I meant to do. Yeah, let's actually get some right over there, too. Oh, okay, so as soon as it hits that last area, it's gone. Okay. What if I did this? Nope, that's not going to work. Okay. Hmm. Gel flow tube, huh? Now, what do I need to do to stop this? Obviously, it's a... Uh... Oh, wait. I gotta hit that button, I guess. Can I do that with... Fuck. What? Oh, God. No, I need to hit the... Orange... No! Damn it. Alright, well, I figured it out at least. Okay, let's try that again. Bounce into that. Boink! Okay, cool. There we go. Oh! I just didn't even, I just didn't see the uh, little sign, or the, the button. Trace amounts of time travel. So, word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time. Mm. Forward and backward. So, do both of yourselves a favor uh -oh. and just let that handsome devil go about his business. Okay, well now I'm up here. Does that do anything for me? No, but what if it did? And there it is. It's about to. Bonk! Alright, I did solve that one pretty easily. Nice. Let's go. Safety first. You will be hurt. Coworkers, don't endanger others. The company, replacements are costly. Science, investigations impede progress. Fair enough. Hmm. Oh, I know. This is the way we were going. Okay, cool. But then again, where do we go after that? The question is science. And science is the question. Now, what will happen if I do this? Probably nothing. See, the answer was... The answer ended up being nothing. Which is very sad. I wished... I, I thought... I was hoping it would do something. Um, but unfortunately, I'm not even really sure where I'm going. Although, it seems to me like this is the right direction. Do I need blue goop? I'm going to guess that I need the blue goop. But I need the blue goop to do what? What do I need? Oh, I need to get up there. I'm just wondering what angle I have to take in order to do that. Unless it's just this. No, it's not nearly bouncy enough. Okay. Um. Unless, of course. Do. That's blue. This is going to be orange. No, actually, you can't really do that. Oh, I see, I see, I see.
There we go. We figured it out without too much trial, without too much trouble. All right. I feel like we're getting the hang of this a little bit. Um. Wait, shit. Where the fuck are we going? Well, I've managed to get up here. Oh, up there. Okay. Okay. I'm no psychiatrist, but coming from a bunch of eggheads who wouldn't recognize the thrill of danger if it walked up and snapped their little pink bras, that sounds like projection. They didn't fly into space, storm a beach, or bring back the gold. No, sir, we did. It's you and me against the world, son. I like your grit. Hustle could use some work, though. Now let's solve this thing. Oh, no. I've got to use water to solve this. Okay. Um, so what's... the big conundrum here okay that's uh sure that's one way to do it <laughs> holy shit there we go oh I see I just have, a, I have to give it a good old wash there we go perfect <laughs> you love this one I mean I also like the bouncy ball one. Bounce. Oh, I see. I see how this goes. Do I... Hmm. Oh. Hold on a second. Hold on a sec. Oh, I, I see how it, I see how this goes. I see how this goes. All right, come on. Yeah, okay, you're bouncy. You're bouncy. All right. Holy shit! Oh, never mind. It's going all over the place. Oh god. Okay. I was hoping it would stay in uh, a stable orbit, so to say. No, it is not staying in anything closely approximating a stable orbit. Um, how long does it stay in a stable orbit? It stays for one bounce. For one bounce, it stays pretty stable. Oh my god. Okay, I see how this is a bit of a puzzle. One, two... I'm dead. Okay. Because I don't think I can get... Oh god. Where did it even go? It's over here now. Okay. Because I don't think I can make it bounce here and then in such extremely short order. Okay, when, I, when I put it down, that goes down right there, right? So I would have to put it down. No. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, no, because if it bounces, it won't stay. It, I, I gotta get it to stay. Which means it has to be clean. The sheer amount of walls is tripping me out, because I know that that means it's gotta be good for something. You had it solved, but you missed. You just missed with the portal before? Okay. Is that what it is? Oh, okay. That was it. <laughs> Fair enough. Why not? Why is so much of our science dangerous? Why not marry safe science if you love it so much? In fact, why not invent a special safety door that won't hit you on the butt on the way out because you are fired? I use that subject. You're doing fine. Yes, you. Box your stuff. Out the front door. Parking lot. Car. Goodbye. Okay, well, I, th I guess I, uh, I guess I outbrained myself.
Thank you for letting me know. I was gonna, I was gonna, <laughs> I was, I was really challenging myself. I'm like, man, if that wasn't the solution, boy, this one's gonna be tough. No wonder Mudlark loves it so much. I notice this is the uh, the exit. <laughs> I'm noticing that this is the exit, but also I can't get out of it. Hmm. Well, I guess let's keep trying. That's obviously a portalable wall. There we go. Friggin' portal messing with my brain. Hey, here's the exit. Really? No. Well, okay then. When it's when it's just as simple as like look up and throw down a portal, it seems pretty easy. Um, but of course it's never it never is. How do we get up there now? Oh, seems like this is going to be the way. Seems like it would be. Is there a way for me to get more gel? Probably not. Oh. I have to imagine that would just go up there. Put that down. Blah, blah, blah. I think I have to moonwalk is the weird thing. Um, excuse me? Because if I come out this way, I need to go back up into the left. What? Ah, oh, no, I was close. I was close. Try that again. At least I'm pretty sure this is just a, a challenging orientation uh, exercise. No, I actually can't get up there. Huh, okay. That's interesting. Oh, whoops. Whoops, 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 whoops. Let's try this again, try this again. So if I don't have enough height to make that vertical jump over here, unless it's got to be... Hmm. Unless there's a button that I missed, which I, I totally could have just missed a button. Any buttons in chat? And by chat, I mean the game that I'm playing currently. There's no way that I can jump that far, right? I, I can't jump. Oh. Maybe if I can get my bearings coming out of this thing. Ah, uh, probably not. What about over here, though? Nope, not definitely not that far. Now, it doesn't seem possible, but... Uh, nope. Okay, I don't think that's going to work. Which means, let's try to... Let's just... Do this. Um, I don't see any portable walls there. Oh, hey, there's one. Hold on. I totally didn't see that one. But wait. Oh, I think I know what I need to do. Okay, okay, okay. I get it. I get it now. I get it now. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to jump over that one. We're going to come out of the orange portal. And then we're going to shoot the blue portal. 
at that wall. And then, booyah, shakalaka. I found it. We're all good. Any secrets? Secrets? Oh, well. I activated the switches and the pumps. So that's good, I guess. Oh my god, this facility is so goddamn big. I just want to leave! I might actually end up playing this whole game on stream. Greetings, friend. I'm Cave Johnson, CEO of Aperture Science. You might know us as a vital participant in the 1968 Senate hearings on missing astronauts. And you've most likely used one of the many products we invented, but that other people have somehow managed to steal from us. Black Mesa can eat my bankrupt... Sir, they can't scan it. Right. Now you might be asking yourself, Cave, just how difficult are these tests? What was in that phone book of a contract I signed? Am I in danger? Let me answer those questions with a question. Who wants to make $60? Cash. You can also feel free to relax for up to 20 minutes in the waiting room, which is a damn sight more comfortable than the park benches most of you were sleeping on when we found you. I'll take a ticket real quick. You're here because we want the best, and you're it. Nope. Couldn't keep a straight face. Anyway, don't smudge up the glass down there. In fact, why don't you just go ahead and not touch anything unless it's test related. Uh, was I supposed to go anywhere over here? That seemed like the right way to go, but, uh... Oh, I, I guess I need to go up there? Yep. I'm not sure what that whole interior part was, but okay. Welcome to the 70s. 60 bucks is a lot for the 70s. Oh, crap. Try that again. Oh, over here. Sweet. Any machinery I can interact with? No. You see an orange jumpsuit hit the red button. Okay, that makes me feel better. It does not make me feel better. And away we go. Ow. Oh, maybe I need to activate the uh, the handrail. <laughs> Moving platform, use the handrail. No, I need to get to the control room first so that I can do all that stuff. But how do I get to the control? Oh, right. I go up there. Cool. Or I have to put the orange one up there so that I can get up there in the first place. And then I can do all the jumpy jumpies and then we'll be fine. Uh, you blue, you orange. All right, let's go now. The control room. God damn it. Once more with feeling. Get excited. I'm excited. We're almost done. We're almost, I think. If we're not almost close... If we're not close to being d finished with the game. And by close, I mean, like, if you don't think I can do it within, like, an, within two hours, then I, I might call it after uh, this mission. And then just do the rest of it later on. Here we go. Uh, no, I'll just leave you. You're about maybe halfway. Oof. Alright, I'll finish this mission then, and then uh, we'll call it.
Okay, let's try this again. Wow. <laughs> Alright, we were off by just a little bit, but apparently off by just enough. Can I... Okay, sweet. 